I'm heading to Italy in a few days. We're going to Venice and Rome, and I wanted to share my itinerary here for anyone who's also planning. We've done a ton of research. This is what we came up with. Note, it's a very, very fast trip. It's only five days. This is just how my mom likes to travel. She doesn't like to be gone long, but she does like to travel. She's paying for it. It's her trip, so I'm gonna do what she wants. But here's our itinerary. So we get in Wednesday night, so all we're gonna do is really just get to the hotel and have dinner. And then on Thursday, we start at 9 a.m. We did book a tour for St. Mark's Basilica, the Doge Palace, and the gondola ride. These are really the main things that you have to pay for. And instead of having to stand in line or maybe not getting a ticket, have to book in advance anyway, because they get busy. Um, we just decided let's just book it all together. And the gondola rides are actually kind of expensive, so just kind of including it just kind of took that expense away from our brains. The rest of the stuff is just stuff that people were like, you should see. Like, we can just walk around Venice and sort of see them. They're free. It's just more about reminding myself what we should be looking for. And then Friday, we are still in Venice. We are going to take the little half-day boat tour to the Moreno and Bereno Islands. There's like glass blowing and it's just really beautiful, so people say. So we're going to do that Friday morning. And then Friday evening, we're going to do a food tour. And I booked this through Airbnb Experience. I've done quite a few of these um, Airbnb experiences in different places. And they're usually really good. So I'm excited about that one. And Saturday morning, we are getting up early and we are taking the train to Rome. And then because we were there on Saturday and Sunday, we can't really do the Vatican and everything on Sunday because they'll be busy having service. So we're gonna do it Saturday night when we get there. We've already booked our tour there. We're glad that we did. We actually booked it like two weeks ago and it was almost completely sold out. So you do plan on doing the Vatican City and Sistine Chapel and stuff. Make sure you book it pretty far in advance. And then Sunday is really our only, we have one full day in Rome and that is it. So we're gonna be doing like the ancient Roman activities so we did book a tour for the Colosseum because we both really enjoy history and we think we'll get the most out of a tour of those that particular site um, and then these are again these are just the other things that we can sort of walk around the city and see and people say you should see when you go to Rome and then through the different blogs and things that I went through I made a list of just different restaurants uh, the top list is for Venice and this bottom list is for Rome so if you want to take a screenshot um, I'll get out of the way and you can do that and then we fly back on Monday and we get home like Monday evening. It's our very fast Italy trip, but I'm really looking forward to it. I've never been to Italy before, so this is definitely gonna be a whirlwind tour of all of the main sites to see. If you have any recommendations, restaurants, anything we should walk to while we're in either of these places, let me know. I'm just happy to put it in our notes and keep an eye out for it while we're there.